Bobby and I, we got to camp late last night around 11 o'clock, so we didn't shoot any of the uh, drive over. But what we're doing and where we're at, we are at East Fort Rock, China Hat, OHV riding area in Central Oregon. We uh, come over every year at this time to do a poker run and ride with some of our friends. Uh, we got here early to make sure we could get a big spot. It's a big weekend. There'll be a lot of riders here for the poker run. So I just want to make sure I get this spot big enough for everybody. I'm not sure. There, 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 I think there might be quite a few people coming. So uh, yeah, Bobby and I, we just got up this morning, took our walk, and now I got to feed this guy, feed myself, and get camp set up. All right, everybody, let me get let me get to my chores. All right, Bobby, let's get you fed. Okay, we've got camp set up. Now, this is not a typical camp for me. Uh, it, well, that's not completely true. I guess it's typical if I'm gonna set up a base camp and be somewhere for a few days. And that's what we're doing here for this trip. This truck probably is not gonna move for three days. So, we got our tire table set up. We borrowed a table, which is actually a pretty nice little table. Sets up real easy for my neighbors, Jenny and Gretchen. Thank you guys very much for that table. Because I don't have my shelf yet. I'm still uh, working out the details. I might buy one. I met a guy or I heard of a guy that builds them. I might try to build one. I like building my own stuff. But anyway, so I have their table. So I have a little more storage for prepping food. Of course, I got the scottle. I mean, it's not overland and camping without a scottle. You don't have a scottle. You're just a poser. All right, uh, we got the last U.S. bag. Remember, I don't know if you know, but mine got stolen out of my driveway. Um, I'm going to try to mount that on the spare tire. It's a great bag. It's a pain in the ass to mount on the spare tire. It, it, it's more difficult than putting up an awning by yourself. The thing is, I don't know, maybe I'm doing it wrong. All right, we got our water. We got our fuel for the motorcycle. Trailers off the side. We've got a set of tires that I didn't get on. So maybe we'll put tires on uh, this weekend. Bob found a stick, looks like. You get that stick, Bob? All right. Okay. So this is our truck. This is our setup for the weekend. We got a ready light back there uh, charging up. I didn't charge it before I left. So, okay. We're set up. Maybe we'll go for a ride. Okay, we're leaving the camp spot for a little bit, we're going for a little rip. Bobby's pretty tired from this morning's activities. He's gonna nap. I'm gonna give a shout out to a YouTuber that I met this fall. We talked, we camped. So Phil, you know what I'm gonna say, don't you? I'm gonna show you the other bike later on in this video. You can come out to Oregon. You can ride this, I'll ride this 300 Husky. My question to you, Phil, are you down to mob, huh? With ATV with Oscar?
All right, the crew is here. Danny and Mike made it. Mike brought us a pile of firewood. That's where the community fire is gonna be. This is gonna be the 50 year and older fire that goes to bed at nine o'clock. So we're cooking some dinner. Uh, so this is the main crew, usually. We usually have Garrett with us or Travis from Beards, Bikes and Camping. But everybody else coming, our newcomers and friends, but the crew's all here. We're gonna start cooking some sausage and tell some stories and get ready for the ride tomorrow. You got six buns and eight dogs. Hey, Danny, Mike. Woo, we're here. We're here. And it's snowing. Mike says, welcome to elk camp. <laughs> Feels more like it than a motorcycle riding trip. More like elk camp than a motorcycle trip. All righty, guys. We're going to cook some food and uh, hang out by the fire. Mikey. Mikey. Can't talk. Okay? <laughs> Hey, do you guys mind if I ask about your carne asada? Oh. Do we come up with our own or do we buy it pre-marinated or what do we do? This is all pre-marinated. This is Costco's. Oh, Costco? Oh, dude, it is bomb too. Well, we're gonna try a little Costco carne asada. Heck yeah. Right on, thanks. You bet. Hey, what do you guys think of the beans and corn and chili? Yeah. Is it okay? Yeah. All right. Excellent. Corn, beans, and chili. You're in China, in the snow. Check it out, we got Rev N3 pulling up. Yeah, flicking the lights at it. You better hurry up because the ribs are just about gone. Apparently, there's a big accident on uh, 20, and so Chris got caught behind that. So no? Uh, motorcycle got crunched. But not, but not snow. No snow out there. This is the only place I've seen snow on this whole trip. We've had snow a couple days.